Hello everyone, my name is Master Rolfus and welcome to Battle for Middle Earth. So when we last left off, we had a couple of ints to take care of, maybe some the trees to drop down, you know, that sort of stuff. The fellowship is broken, and the ring bearer wa huh. wanders alone in the wilderness. Now, Fangorn shall burn to fuel the forges of Orthanc. Well, we already, already had that little bit of a dialogue um, called down to us, but oh well, we can hear it again, I suppose. Fangorn is the ancient home of the Ents, an excellent source of fuel to drive the engines of industry. Right, time to take care of some ints. The ints draw their strength from the int boot. We must destroy it. By the way, um, I was about to say this, but Saruman kind of um, we have much work to do. Stopped Feed me from saying it. With wood from the great forests of Fangorn. But it's fuel. We shall breed a mighty army. But essentially, uh, I'm using the Warhammer 40k Space Marine soundtrack right now, as I've had to mute the Battle for Middle Earth uh, soundtrack, mostly due to copyright issues. I should probably back off that guy. Yeah, let's get the Isengar, uh, the Urukai troops back here, and just send in the uh, Crossbowmen. It seems like they go berserk as soon as uh, they're about to die. Alright, let's move forward. Honestly, the Space Marine music is pretty good for YouTube videos as it's not too loud. But also on top of that is uh, pretty fantastic to listen to. Nothing will stand in our way. Shoot for the next. Isengard will prevail. None shall oppose us. All right, build a camp. Victory is at hand. That's not a camp. That's like a there fucking house. Rid me of these elves. Spare no one. Destroy the elves. Nothing will stand in our way. Embrace my power. All right, fireball right there. In the Let kisser. Go now. And a wizard blast would be nice. Okay, we're good here, and then level yeah, the furnace. Why not? Now what else? What else? Isengard armory. Now the inwood's right over there. We should probably take that out eventually. But let me see. Yeah, cost of upgrades goes down because of a fur the furnace. So probably a good idea to do that. Keep spamming those. I use devastation power to clear trees. Ah, it's right over here. Oh, we don't have access to it. Oh well. Fire arrow damage would be. I mean, upgrade would be nice, and then we can get a furnace again. And I think that's the only uh, production place I can really get. I'll try to get a slaughterhouse, see what that will give me. Yeah, upgrade everybody to fire arrows right now. I can't get forged blades, which is kind of gay. But let me see. Let me. Yeah, let me, I guess, destroy this. Because there's no point of it existing. Alright, so. Furnaces. Uh. Yeah, just spam more of those. Alright, 
Alright, Orkai, you're doing pretty good. It's time for us to push forward again. Oh, shit. The elves came out of nowhere. Alright, now we have banner carriers that will allow us to uh, heal up some troops. Whoosh. None shall oppose us. We have work to do. There we go. Some powers here and there would be very nice, and then we can get that little upgrade here. Oh. Keep forgetting, it's left click, then right click. Oh! Hey, got sour man. I didn't even pay attention. It's pretty incredible, actually. Can I rebuild sour man? Yeah, I can. This doesn't cost that much. Kind of insane. Yeah, I didn't realize the instant damage damage. Can you guys uh, finish off those elves? Let's get an outpost. I like this. This is really cool. Now everybody move down there. Yeah, I really like this whole, like, um, setup, actually. Like, I like how all of your buildings are attached to the Citadel, and then afterwards... Uh, you only have a limited amount of spots, so you have to fight for more, uh, spots for more resources and stuff like that. Like, I don't know, I don't like the Battle for Middle-Earth 2's method of building, uh, construction, mostly because... You have to constantly try and find good, sp uh, spaces for... Your resource-gathering structures, and it kind of could get a little bit, um... It could get a little bit, uh, what's, what's the word, what's the word? Tedious. Tedious. I don't know, this is just way more simpler. Like, I would like free base building, but not like how Battle for Middle-Earth 2 does it. With those resource depots. Everything else is okay, though. I guess I do like building walls. This, this method of construction is also used in Edine Mod, and I understand why that's the case. Alright. Thank you for that. Come, my servants. Incoming elves we're gonna have to deal with. Can you guys also attack me? We lost our man again. He dies in one hit to those ends. Yeah, how about we all focus fire on the ends right now? What are you doing? Come on. Here we go. Keep firing, boys. Keep firing. Oh, shit. Back, back, back. Come on. Keep firing, keep firing. Ooh. Oh, I can't use devastation. 
Right, because I picked a different tree. Firing at the elves. Feel that guy good. Elves keep spawning. Tricks to like whoosh. Who's that? Is that Tree Beard? That is Tree Beard. Can't confirm. Come on, boys. Come on. Keep firing. Okay, stay in position. Keep firing. Keep firing. I understand that this is not the most ideal situation, but. You know, some people don't want to be shipped uh, shipped to South Korea for their military service, and some do. In general, you can't really choose where you're sent to. You just gotta kind of deal with it. So you might be sent against some ints, but we're gonna have to kill some ints, okay? So yeah, be a little bitch about it now. Isengard, come on, Isengardians, let's come on, Orokai, Crosswoman, you get get back! Don't get killed by the ints again for the millionth billionth time. Oh shit. One kick. That's all it takes. One kick. Come on guys. Fire at the end moot. If I use the fireball, wow, that didn't help at all. We need a lot more forces. Maybe if I send in some orc laborers. I mean, if I bring back some of my guys to the citadel, maybe I can like get some heals. But ah, eh, that's that's gonna take way too long. I need this is fine. How many fire arrows does it take to destroy a rock? The world may never know. Oh, it's done. It's over. I was gonna get more resources from the furnace. Stained with the blood of men. Get wrecked. Alright. So, you know what? I'm just not going to level up these or a crossbowmen. It's just going to take too long. Yeah, we're good. We're good. In the future, I'm going to increase the volume on the movie so the that you guys can hear it more. The stands ready with spear and sword. The annihilation of Rohan begins. Yeah, hold on a second. Let me go ahead and... Increase the volume of movies so that you guys can always hear that shit. And we're going to end this part off on a good note. I will see you guys next time where we kill Rohan. Alright, bye bye everyone.